What day is it? What day is it, Luna? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. This is Wednesday. Wednesday, the 13th of October. It's about 11 a.m. Taking the dog out. Um, thought a change of scenery instead of a car. Uh, yeah, crazy craziness. Yesterday, absolutely exhausted. But hopefully now we have a okay uh, day today at work. Um, just heading in, got to do some odds and ends before we get in. Luna's out here doing the biz. There she blows. Look at over this. We've got some mushrooms over there. We've got a big old mushroom coming over there. Um, but yeah, in the wild, wild west of PA. Give it some, Luna, give it some. So we're heading off to uh, FedEx. I actually just pitched up right now. Send this uh, old phone back. Try and get some money uh, with trade in. Uh, old iPhone, you know, we've just got a new Android, so that's my next chore, and then I think I'm heading off to work. All right, job done. That has been sent out of my hands, and hopefully, hopefully, um, follow through on that badger. So let's get off to me. Now, yesterday wasn't, to be all honestly, it wasn't it, on paper, it wasn't that bad. However, we did have a, a highbrow event which required a lot of hands on deck at uh, a moment's notice uh, with a lot of possibilities for things to go awkwardly wrong. Um, and that took up a core cool part of the day. Like I arrived like, I arrived actually early, maybe an hour earlier than, uh, than probably scheduled and today. Like, I might end up there about half an hour earlier than scheduled. Um, but uh, the core work was mostly done. They had to do a, a little bit of work to get things set up. But um, um, it was a pretty, pretty straightforward day today. On paper, I did look ahead. It did look um, there is some work, work to be done. But I'm hoping it's not going to be too, too late. Tomorrow looks like a good day on paper. Nice early start. So uh, yeah, we are. We're hoping for an easier day or two here, and into next week. So it should hopefully slow down a little bit because I'm not really, I've really had zero time to breathe. And that's I know it sounds stupid, but it, I'm, I'm you know came home last night I did have three beers and for me that's 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 crazy levels I don't have three beers I don't even have a beer but I was just so wiped because of the journey the up and down to North Carolina you know I did all the driving I know that doesn't sound I should be doing all the driving anyway I should be doing it but it was all the driving but I had pigeonholed that time where I was driving to you know to if we could split it and I'd have like four hours as a passenger I could have done a lot of my university homework so I, I didn't get any of that done on, on on Monday so I was doing all the driving and then our, our, our visitors are there and you know to walk in on that and to, to, to pour some uh, dinner out my backside um, and just have just be able to entertain fucking fly in a car um, was quite tricky and then the next day work but then I realized that I didn't do any of my homework and I'm, I'm, I'm Scrambling to do that, got some videos to pull on my backside and just deal with work and to work into walk into work with um with the high pressure of this this high, uh, big time event. Um, it was just quite a chaotic day. So today I'm hoping for a little less manic, even though we've had a call off for the morning, we've had a call off for the afternoon, but I'm still hoping that there's going to be enough guys to uh, get most of the work done to make it a, a, a less than stressful day. Looking forward to my lunch though. I've got um, got some cereal, I've got donut, I've got coffee, I've got my chicken and rice, uh, I've got potential bread rolls. I've, I've got, I've got, I've got uh, I'm spoiled for choices. Um, and hopefully tonight we, we will have pulled pork. Uh, I, I made it yesterday. Um, 
but again I don't know what my plans are for, for my visitors what they're doing because they you know they're visiting folks I think today they're actually fixing um, because uh, Tom's a handyman um, he's actually able to crack a fiction hour uh, or replacing our air conditioner um, but uh, yeah yesterday they decided to go to visit Rachel and the gang over in Alexandra Huntington about 35 ish minutes away and they ate out there with a Stromboli or whatever so my pulled pork was kind of put on hot on the back burner but um, yeah I put it in the fridge reheated it up today and um, hopefully they'll get into that and I can keep on being the host hostess for the mostest um, and just keep on trucking the wife is also not feeling too great still she gets her COVID test results back today um, so that could if it goes the wrong way be a bit of a spanner in the works for my work and just all that kind of stuff so uh, yeah anyway I'll check in with you later on but um, yeah it's a, it's a hopscotch kind of day today not, not really sure where we're gonna go but um, hoping for an easy one